I'm going to demonstrate quick sort. It's a sorting algorithm. And it's recursive, so it's not all visual, but I still understand things through visual, so we'll see if this helps you. So here's an unordered array of values. We want it to be A to Z, lowest, highest. Insertion, I'm sorry, quick sort, uh, will basically sort a partition and then recursively sort the left and right side. So a partition is just a chosen block. So let's take um, F as our partition. I'm just randomly choosing one, which you can do, and there's cost um, impact on that, which you can think later, but right now let's just do a basic uh, quick sort. F is the partition. Make sure every value going down this side and that side are less than F and greater than F. So D is less than F. H is greater. So this needs to go out. I is greater. So on this side we want it to be greater. So anything that's less than needs to move. These are actually all fine. So this is going to go over here. Q is also greater. It's going to go over there. B is not. So now you see we already have kind of a chunk of organized some order here. So now F is the partition. Now we're going to say on this side, let's make sure these are, let's pick a partition here. Let's pick D. B is less than D. These are ordered correctly. On this side on F, let's pick a partition like Y. So see, this is the recursive element. We're kind of nesting and nesting until the whole thing is ordered. Is I, we can just know all of these are greater than so it doesn't matter where they are, they just have to be on this side of the Y. It doesn't matter where they are in this set, it's be greater than the Y. So now we will partition this side of Y, which is nothing. This side we will now sort recursively with our quick sort. So let's pick I. H is in the right place. Q needs to go over here. RL is over here. So now we'll sort this side. HI is correct. RL. And what? Look, it's ordered. How did that happen? magic. No, it's quick sort. So the cost of this is kind of complex. If you could see what's going on as I was always, I, we don't have to scan the entire array. So it's not a quadratic one. It's, you're partitioning it. So it's basically the size of the partition. So it's n whatever partition uh, cost you use. That's why I said it would be a little more complex. Um, generally n log n is the cost of, of a quick sort.